Hey guys, Pablo with BND and today at Top Reddit Post we're gonna be taking a look at choosing beggars. And don't forget to subscribe, hit that notifications button and leave us a like and a comment in the end of this video. Selling an old Mac 27 inch on eBay and just got to meet this jam. Posted by u slash pennies. Hey, is the iMac still available? How much you want for it? Hello? I want it. Hello? I want that. Don't sell it to other people. It is still available, yes. The price is 100 euro. What year is it? It's the 2011 model, 27 inches. 100 is too much for that stuff. Can you make it lower? I need to buy it. It's for college. Sorry, the price is set. It's 100 euro. I recently upgraded the RAM in this and it has a 512 gigabyte SSD. It's worth easily 450. Euro. I'm prepared to take a hundred for it since it's just sitting around taking up my desk space. A hundred for no sell. I can't go lower than that. Can just buy Joe for me bay for a hundred with a freaking guarantee in it like new. New, not Joe. Then I wish you the best of luck. Thanks for dropping by. Screw you. Hey you. Hey. Is a Mac still available? I thought it from you because I trust you more than eBay people. Because they're asking for too much and I want the one from you because because it's only a hundred and has better hard drive. Plus, I like how we joked about it last time, haha. <laughs> Sorry, but it's not available anymore. Someone else contacted me to buy it right after you said you didn't want it anymore. Seriously? You're a douchebag because you obviously hate black people. Screw you, white douche. Take your 100 euro and shove it. Douche, can't you see I got no money? And I want that Mac and you keep stopping me from buying it. Just sell it to me. I can't help you, sorry. It's agreed with another seller. And even if they don't collect, I'll move on to someone else who isn't a complete freaking idiot. Please, I need for my college work. I got no money, can't even afford rent this month. The irony of that statement. What is it for me then? I want it now. When can you deliver? I'm not sending you a thing. Please leave me alone. You just hate me because I'm not German, you racist. You think it's easy being an immigrant. I got no money and I need that Mac. Leave me alone. Screw you. Bye. Piece of shot. Ciao. And other words. Freaking Nazi. Hey guys, listen up, nobody has to sell you anything, okay? And the most if you're a douche to them, definitely they don't have to sell anything to you. The actual kid has his mom threatened to report our company for fraud. We'll post link to the original content and comments. To whom it may concern, it was recently being made clear to me that your company promised my son a free board and then retracted that promise. I understand that Jay acted out of line in requesting something other the 8.5 board you offered him. That was wrong of him, and after speaking to him, he is willing to accept the 8.5 instead of the 8 he desperately wanted. Also, I want to apologize on behalf of Jay for threatening to sue you. He is an 11-year-old child who does not have the resources. Do not worry, he will not be suing you. Let me know how we can proceed in getting my son the free board he deserves. Thank you. Hi D, I do not remember promising your son a free board. Board. Do you have any evidence that someone in our company may have offered this to him? Hello? Yes, I do. There is this conversation between your company and Jay on Instagram. His username is super douche too. I am sure you can find it on your end as well. As you can see, he was clearly told he could have an 8.5 for free. Please let me know how I can receive this board for my son. He is a good kid. He deserves it. Thank you. Ah uh, yes, that kid. Sorry will not be providing a free board for him under any circumstances. You can buy one for full price directly from our website if you still want one. They're about $40 plus shipping. Of course, shipping is free if you buy more than $50 of merchandise. I really think he deserves a free board. You promised him. Not giving Jay a free board would be fraud. And I would hate to report your company as fraudulent. Also, think about how many people Jay will get your product in front of when you give it to him. You will be making so much money from all the new sales he brings in. When you think about it like that, you should be paying him to ride your board. Thanks. Uh, no, we're not giving him a free skateboard under any circumstances. His behavior cannot be rewarded. As a company, we expected better from the skate community than the way your son spoke to us. 
Wow, you're being such a freaking douche. He's a child that made a mistake, and now you're refusing to give him what he's rightly owned. Please forward this to your supervisor. We're going to get you fired. Also, we're still going to report fraud even if you give us a board just to teach you a lesson. Unless, of course, you give us something else in addition to a free board. The harps ahead? Thank you. Report us as fraud then, I do not care. I'm not giving you any free gear. We will not be responding further to your emails. Also, I own the company. Screw yourself! Thanks! And now following the actual message between them. Actually, my company won't give you a board. Hey, can I have a freeze board? We don't usually do that, but we have some 8.5s that we can give away. Actually, I skate on 8. We don't have an 8, it's just 8.5. But you said I can have it! Yes, if you want the 8.5, you can have it. Actually, I said a 1 and 8. We can get you an 8 for 40 bucks plus shipping. Actually, you said it would be free. No, we can give an 8.5 free. Also, you'd probably still need to pay shipping. Actually, you send me an 8 for free. You pay shipping too. Uh, no. Actually, you meant to say yes. I don't want to get my lawyers involved. A uh, lawyer would cost you more than buying a board? Actually, you have to pay for the court fees too and we win. Actually, you will send me an 8 for free. You pay for shipping too. No. Look, I'm done trying. You can't have the 8.5 either. Actually, I can. Dude, actually, you and your mother are douche and the biggest choosing beggars I've ever heard. I know I've been out of the scene for a while, but does people actually say actually every single sentence nowadays? Where's the world going to? Why do? Posted by u slash jcz1739. Hey man, thanks for the silver, but can I have platinum please? No. Why not? Help out, man. Did you like my post? Kind of left. Give me platinum. Hello, freaking freak. Hey guys, it's Reddit, but it's still be nice to people. Since I will have a logo made by you, I'll be giving you free exposure since I will have a watermark of yours permanently on my page. Posted by u slash Courser. Do you still do minimalistic logos? Uh, yeah, are you interested? Let me see some of your work first. Here's my work. What do you think? Okay, I'll have one with the initials CH, black and white. Okay, it's a uh, $8 PayPal. The hell? I ain't paying anything. I thought this was a nice person making logos. Plus I'm giving you exposure, cause I basically got your watermark permanently on my page. Uh, sorry I misled you. Have a nice day. Hey guys, trust me. I get if the guy is really, really big and someone comes up to him and offer to give him something for exposure, it may be okay. But you don't do that. That that's that's as messed up as two boys having fun on a church on Sunday. How dare my dying father live out the rest of his life? Posted by u slash ahdcow. Hello, I'm here for advice to vent. My dad sold his company for 4 mil and recently was diagnosed with cancer. He was told he would only have a few years to leave. He has chosen to go back to college to further his education before he passes. Waste of money. He has also booked a cruise around the world that is non-refundable. I feel like he's blowing through all the money that I'm entitled to my inheritance. Parents own each their children to live a sizable nest egg after they pass and I want what's mine. How should I stop him from blowing through all my money? Damn, you might have to go earn a living, dude. Your father earned what he got. Good luck to him. Life is short, so enjoy it while you got it. Wow, really? You selfish kids are entitled to anything. I lost my beautiful mom last year and I'd rather have her than any amount of money. You're absolutely vile. My dad would never date any of you slobs. Guys, oh my god, I mean, they're choosing beggars and then you have this guy. That's that's kind of insane. I mean, try to deny his dad to live his last few years. Just get a job. Bake me a cake or I'll tell HR on you. Re-upload to hide names. Posted by u slash Yufka. Hey Ann, I learned from Jay that you baked a cake for his team on his birthday. 
It's my birthday next week. Can you bake me a cake and bring it to the office? It's free, right? Hi. Yes, I bake it for him because in our team we usually pull money to buy a cake or someone volunteers to make it for them instead. Are you sure you want me to bake it? I've never spoken to anyone on your side of the office and I don't know if it would make any sense if I came and gave it to you and your team. <laughs> I was gonna buy a cake, but it's free to ask you to make it, so... Can you do this cake? On Monday, bring it to my desk at 2, and I'll just give it to everyone, so it's not awkward for you to talk to my people. It's Ferrero Rocher's and Lean Truffles and stuff, but you can just count the cost as my birthday gift, lol. I can make you a box cake or cookies? What the hell, you're joking, right? lol. No, I'm really sorry, but the fact that you just want me to make this cake and deliver it to your desk so you can present it as your own contribution makes no sense to me. Also, I'm going to be kind of busy this week and dog sitting. I think maybe it's best for you to order a cake so you know it will be up to your standard or something. You think I have the money for that? Please. You're my co-worker. It's my birthday. I want this cake. Sorry, I really can't. See you tomorrow. I'm going to avoid you in the office from now on and tell everyone how you really are. Watch your back, HR might want a word with you soon. Hey guys, careful at workplace. And, and you know, the saddest thing, like, it's hard for you to even do nice things to your own people because other people are gonna feel entitled for you to do the same for them, even if you never even saw the person in the past. And that stuff about HR, that's just stupid talk. I mean, you know, I, I always say that, like, some people need drugs. I mean, real, 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 real strong drugs. Like, they need a professional to prescribe that stuff for them because this is crazy and guys i hope you really like this video um don't forget to subscribe give a thumbs up leave a comment and hit the notifications bell and i'll be seeing you guys tomorrow with more top reddit posts have a good night